Active adult communities are very common throughout Arizona. In fact, some of the first active adult communities were founded right here in Phoenix. They're often confused with a separate type of senior housing called independent living. However, these are not the same thing and there are several very important differences. Today, we're gonna to be talking about active adult communities and independent living communities and the top three differences that you need to know about. Hi everyone, I'm Rob King, the co-founder of Valley Senior Advisors. We help seniors in the Phoenix area find the best care and our services are at zero cost. Today, we're gonna to be talking about active adult communities and the differences between independent living communities. Let's first start by defining active adult communities. An active adult community, also referred to as an age-restricted community or a 55 plus community, is designed for seniors who want a quieter lifestyle and wanna live among their peers. One of the first and longest running communities is Sun City, located in the West Valley of Phoenix. It was founded by Del Webb in 1960. There are usually many living options in active adult communities, from condos, townhomes, to freestanding homes, and residents have the option to rent or own their property. There's a lot of variance in size and scope of these communities, ranging from small apartment style communities all the way to larger master plan communities similar to Sun City. These communities generally offer a lot of amenities like golf and tennis for more active seniors, hence the name. So now that we've talked about active adult communities, let's review independent living communities. I recently made a video about independent living communities and the top four things to consider when looking for a community. You can find a link to that video in the description, but here's a quick review. Independent living is for seniors who live independently but would like access to healthcare services when needed. They're generally set up as private apartments or townhomes and will offer dining services and meal packages for their residents. You'll generally find a variety of amenities and they'll vary depending on the community that you're looking at. Now let's talk about some key differences between active adult communities and independent living communities. Number one is access to on-site healthcare services. Independent living offers access to on-site healthcare services where active adult communities do not. That being said, if you live in an active adult community and you wanna coordinate a third party company to provide healthcare services, you can do so. It just won't be provided by the community itself. Number two is rent versus own. In independent living communities, you rent your space. You don't have the option to purchase the property that you're living in. In active adult communities, you often have the option to buy your property. Now with that comes the responsibility for maintenance and upkeep of your property. Now owning your property may be desirable, but you may also want to avoid it so you can focus on taking advantage of the amenities and socializing with those in your community. And number three is the size and scope of the communities. Active adult communities can vary from small apartment style communities all the way up to larger master plan communities like Sun City. Independent living communities are generally apartment style communities or can be part of a larger community called a continuing care retirement community. All right, that's it for today's video. If you found this information helpful, please like this video and consider subscribing to the channel. You can also hit the notification bell to be notified of when we post new videos. And finally, Valley Senior Advisors is committed to helping seniors in the Phoenix area find the best care. If we can answer any questions or help you in your search, please let us know. One of our care advisors would be happy to help and our services are 100% free. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.